Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 11 KB5012592 is now available and started rolling out on the 12th of April 2022. Now, once this update has been applied, the latest um, OS build now for the current stable version of Windows 11 will be OS build 22000.613. Now, compared to last month's Patch Tuesday update that rolled out for Windows 11, um, this is very thin on the ground when it comes to new features with KB5012592, and there's not too much to report on, and is mainly, like all the Patch Tuesday updates, a security update, um, a security update that brings security improvements, important security improvements to the Windows 11 operating system. Now, the security updates that have rolled out are very similar for both the Windows 11 and Windows 10 operating system. And I did post a video on the Windows 10 update that rolled out a short while ago. Now, just to mention some of the um, details regarding the security fixes which have rolled out for both Windows 11 and Windows 10, is that the update includes fixes for 119 vulnerabilities. And it's important to note that that's just not for Windows 11 and Windows 10. That's across all the Microsoft products and services. And 47 of those 119 vulnerabilities were, are um, elevation of privilege vulnerabilities. And another 47 are remote code execution vulnerabilities, which means they can be exploited remotely on your system. And then there's nine denial of service flaws as well. And 10 of the security issues are rated as critical, which is your highest rating when it comes to security vulnerabilities. And three are zero day vulnerabilities. So this is an important security update that is rolled out for Windows 11. Now, if you'd like to see if you have the update, as always, we just head to the settings menu and go over to Windows Update. And the Patch Tuesday updates, as you know, are um, compulsory automatic updates and will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And once uh, the, the update has been downloaded and installed, you will have to restart your machine. And once restarted, you can just head over to Update History and just the update, cumulative update for Windows 11 KB5012592. And you can click on Learn More to take you to the release notes to get some more uh, in-depth information if you are interested regarding the update. Now, this security update includes all the improvements that were part of update KB5011563, which is this update, which rolled out near the end of March, which was an optional bug fix update. So if you installed KB5011563, then um, only the new updates contained in this update, which rolled out uh, um, on the 12th, will be downloaded and installed on your device. Now, if you didn't install 5011563, the optional bug fix update that rolled out near the end of March, then all those bug fixes and improvements and one or two new add-ons and features will be uh, rolled out with the latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update as well. And just to mention some of those, um, there was a, a new notifications feature, a watermark um, for unsupported uh, devices, and numerous bug fixes as mentioned. And uh, um, the update carries improvements and uh, uh, fixes numerous issues as it is an optional bug fix update. And as mentioned, makes important changes to the way the notifications work in Windows 11. And I will leave a link to that optional update video 5011563 down below if you are interested. Um, just in case you didn't install it because those improvements will roll out in this latest Patch Tuesday update. So that's more or less um, what's new in this latest update. As, as mentioned, it's very thin on the ground when it comes to new features, but is mainly a very important security update addressing 10 critical security flaws and three of those have already been exploited in the wild. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.